right, welcome back to Every Room is a different Wikipedia article. Um, last time when I went back, when I was editing this, I realized maybe for this room, the Taylor Swift room, I should have gone, I don't know, grandma ish i don't you know the girls who who like horses sorry for anyone who is a taylor swift fan but she reminds me of a horse girl but i feel like i should have did like a fluffy bed a whole bunch of like cat and dog stuffed animals everywhere went super soft pinks and whites but I mean, this this is still good. I still like this, but I definitely should have did that on her side. I did go in and change some, we'll add some more stuff only to this bedroom because I feel like it wasn't, it was kind of boring. So I changed the rug out and then I added this little, what is that? A skeleton and the dirt pile. And it looks a little bit better for the theme. Um. Oh yeah. And I added that light. But yeah, that's what, so yeah, that's what I did last time. The glacial room, Taylor Swift, the ship hallway game room still hate that room um what is this mason bathroom and then the egypt for the bedroom so let's go ahead and figure out what we're going to do on this side um this is such a small little area i might skip that because it's, it's nothing it's a hallway so let me go to the bathroom that's right here and see what they're gonna what i'm gonna choose for that one I'm going to start back up from the top for this um, and then just scroll down. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then do my mouse thingy. Did I click anything? Yeah, I did. Josh Hutcherson. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I mean, I know who he is, but how I'm going to do a bathroom as an actor hey he was a voice actor in Howl's moving castle who was he um should i pick one of his movies to go with or a tv show because if i do that i th think i would want to go with what was that show that he was in that i really liked that was on um hulu a dystopian show the video game thingy I'm going to look it up, but I think if I do this as a bathroom, it's just going to be a really dystopian bathroom based off of that show. I'll figure it out um, when I switch over and let you guys know what it was. So the show was called Future Man. I freaking loved that show. It was so funny. Um, I think with that one, I might choose, I think it's the second season where they're in, it's kind of Mad Max's, they're Max's. Um, they're in a desert and i think that's the one i'm gonna go with i don't know what i'm gonna come up with right here but we shall see i'm gonna put some windows in here and then i also decided that i cannot talk and design anything period so i'm gonna end up doing this as a speed and then see you guys right after but i think that's what I'm going to go with. I don't know how close that is to him himself. I don't know who he is as a person. I don't really want to do any research on it. So I'm just going to choose a movie, TV show that he's been in and go from there. Have you ever fallen out of love? We hide and play dumb or change the station to push turns into show. We get so clever and covering it up. Everyone knows our hearts in their holes. There's water in the boat. Bittersweet words dancing in my mouth. But I can't get them out. Truth is I'm tired of lying. To myself, I've been trying to figure out what went wrong. Oh, was it wrong all along? Truth is, I'm tired of lying. To myself, I've been trying. You ain't the one. Our time is up. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. Bring it up. 
Just me and you, a table for two, but we're not saying much. Baby, all my hopes can never be enough. Thirsty for more, the wine that you pour is poisoning my cup. Get them out. Truth is, I'm tired of lying to myself. I've been trying to figure out what went wrong. Oh, was it wrong all along? Truth is, I'm tired of lying. All right, I think that's all I'm going to do in here. Um, if no one has ever seen the show, uh, Josh, Josh Hutcherson, oh my goodness, his character is a gamer. Um, and people come from the future the game he's playing was a message from the future that people sent and they think he's the chosen one to save the future from a dystopian like whole catastrophe he's not he's so he's horrible he's shit <laughs> but this is what it's based off of it's such a good show i wish it hadn't been canceled i think it was only like three seasons but yeah i just designed it off of that um so it's a little bit messy as you can see, uh, the bathroom is beautiful. I kind of really love it. And then I put the little gaming picture in here just because he is a gamer and that's how it all got started. Uh, so that is my Josh Hutcherson bathroom. All right, let's go on to the kitchen and see what we get for that one. Okay, I'm going to stay where I'm at right here. I'm not going to scroll back up. So I'm just going to scroll down some and go from there. So one two, three, four, five, six. Scroll my mouse around. Did I click anything? I can't see anything changing out the side of my eye. What's happening? God of War Ghost of Sparta. I've never played this game. <laughs> Is this whole side of the house just going to be dystopian bullcrap? I mean, I'm cool with it, but goodness, it's going to be super dark. Um, Let me read what this is about. I'm trying, maybe I should look up imagery for this because it is gods and you associate gods with like kind of fancy things. So maybe I can use get famous in the kitchen or like just high end stuff, but make it dark. Uh, I don't know. So I'm not too sure what I'm going to do with this, but I did look up pictures and it looks what is it cold so everything looks super steamy so what i just did off camera really quick because i wanted to see if it'll work is i built a basement level um right below the kitchen and then added what is this the platform type of thing i just raised up the floor and then added this little grate we're going to ignore the bubbles but it's giving off the steamy effect that i kind of want going on in here so we're going to keep it is this centered where i want it uh we'll keep it there for now but i'm going to do that and jump right into the speed build for this Stuck in my feelings these days I've been up in my bedroom now days Even with the sun shining so bright I wait till stars come at night So I could dream about you tonight Truth, truth, truth is I'm a little bit hesitant to hit you up I 
get more scared as a damn grown up. This ain't a hookup, we could just burn up. I, I, I feel you so close up. I'm so sorry if I close up the truth. been good at no no chasing ways to have it to myself just like i should yeah controlling all of my thoughts i want you on my body turning me on baby you know you got me got me tripping over all of these lines i can't fight It's the morning, yeah, yeah. Wind me up one. Looking, you can read me like a story. Controlling all of my thoughts. I want you on my body. Turning me on, baby. You know you got me. Got me tripping over all of these lines. I can't lie. Yeah. I think this might be my God of War um, kitchen. I don't know. There was, uh, what I was trying to do was incorporate stone and wood, kind of like the bathroom because of um, the time period it's supposed to be set in. But I didn't want to make it too dark because when I was looking at the pictures, it looked very fantasy-esque and I really liked that. So what you didn't see was me going through debug trying to find these swords. I knew we had them. I could not find them. I was in debug for freaking ever. So I added the swords for that. Um, I also found this bow and arrow. Did not know that was in the game. So that's really cute. Um, and then I just put a fish right here. I don't, I'm pretty sure we have a chopping board, but I don't know where it is and I'm not looking for it right now. Maybe uh, at the end, when I go back through and make sure everything looks the way I want it to, I'll go ahead and put that over there and put it underneath the, the fish. But yeah, I think that's it for it. I've tried to go fantasy, like a, like a pub kind of vibe with the chairs and the wood and everything. And I think it came out kind of cute. This is really, I, I like this room. Um, it might be a little bit too dark, but I don't know. I think it fits. I'm going to keep it like that for now, and if at the end I want to change it, I'll come back and do that. But let's go over to the last room, the living room. So let's go see what we get for this little setup. So I'm trying to figure out if I want to scroll up or down for this last room. I'm thinking, I don't know, let's scroll back up. Let's see what we get. So one, two, three, and then do this. Did I click on anything? I can't see anything pop up. Teresa Christina of the Two Sicilies. Nicknamed the mother of Brazilians. Okay. So we're definitely going, we're definitely going king and queen here. So this room is going to be our extravagant room for sure. So the colors of Brazil are yellow, green, and red. So I'm going to try to incorporate that into the build. I don't want to just put one window in here. Mm, 
and then two on this side to match. Hey, what happened to that window? Ah, uh, just one window. That's rude. Leave back my window. Hey. Got it. Okay, let me also move this um lamp over here. I gotta change that color. Let's make these match. It's gonna bother me. They still don't match. Get up. They are off. Okay. All right, yeah, so yellow, green, and red. So that's the colors that are gonna go in this room. I already used red on the walls. Not red, yellow on a wall, green on a wall. So this room is gonna have a red wall. Um, uh, well, the prominent color I think is green. I think it was green. Maybe it should be a green wall. Mm. I don't know. Um, well, let me just jump into the speedboat and I guess you guys will figure out which one what I go with. Your future like a Squeeze. 
Don't get it twisted. There's a problem, we gonna fix it. This ain't the type of thing you lose. So let's keep on doing what we do. Mm. Driving me wild, giddy up like a stallion. Saddled up and right, Joe, we crossing the line like a champion. Okay, so this is my room um, based off of Teresa Christina of the Two Sicilies. I think this came out really nice. It's super, I don't know, bougie looking. I might need to move this lamp. I was going to put something on that table, then I decided not to. But this is so, I don't know, extravagant, but also cozy. Vampires came in clutch with the, the lamps. I love those. I couldn't find any CC couches that were the color yellow that I wanted, so I just used the end game ones. But it goes. Like, I made it work. Um, so, yeah, that's what I did for that one. These two rooms are kind of cohesive. They kind of go together a little bit with the colors. Uh, the bathroom, that's a different story, but I still really like it. It's so... I love that aesthetic. Uh, so, just to recap, this was the the queen room this was god of war um i really wish i had played the game so i knew what to put in there but that's what that is and then this is josh hutcherson i don't know why i can't say his name properly <laughs> but that's his bathroom from the show that he was in um i already forgot what it was even though i really love it but yeah that show the glacier front room when you walk in the Taylor Swift 1989 bedroom. Sorry, again, for any Swifties out there, I don't know her stuff. Uh, the game room that I got, what is it, Snooker? S sneaker? Snooker? I don't know, I forgot that too. Uh, the ship hallway. The something Pope or whoever he was bathroom, so I just went with the masonry. And then the Egyptian ruin of Tutankhamun uh, right here. So yeah, that is my room is a diff every room is a different uh Wikipedia article. I will go ahead and just real quickly put some wallpaper in this hallway. It really doesn't matter. Um even though I'm gonna take forever to try to figure it out. Let's use the same wall stuff that's in there. And bring in this. I should have put some transition strips because that's wild. But yeah, that's the end of the video. That was kind of fun. I think next time, um, I kind of want to do a bigger, like bigger spaces because there's more stuff I want to put in here. And there's also more stuff, more stuff I want to put in this one. But all in all, I think it came out really well. Um, so I'm going to end the video here and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.